All right, we are back with this again. So last time we were eyeing off Russia for potential liberation and the Great Revolution. Coming in right now, we're gonna build up as much as we can. Basically, make sure that uh, once we do this shit, that uh, it's not gonna fucking collapse in on itself, all right? Yeah, we got this. We got. I don't know. Are they in a faction again? No, they're not. Okay. All right, we good. We great. You amazed? Be amazed. Forever amazed. Also, we're building up the Karl Marx line. Fortress of the people, improve constructions, conversions. In the meantime, let us. Ah, I can wait. Yeah, uh, this should probably make this so you can bypass that. You know, just in case. As always, Yakucha dead. They're gonna go there. Old International is doing, doing amazing. Our boy Trotsky about to uh, probably invade Siberia. Using the war with Russia to their advantage. And soon enough, we'll invade Russia. How's the tank core we're doing? The tank core is doing remarkably well. Now, I have a very dumb idea I'd like to try out. It's a very stupid idea, but I want to do it anyway. <laughs> yeah, I guess we could see how that backfires. But I, I want to test something out real quick. There's some heavy tanks in here to support the infantry. Actually... I guess we could even this out a wee bit. Um. This not make the most sense. We're developing quite the force here. Oh man, this is gonna be quite the war we have. I was I was curious to see if this would actually work. I did it like once before, about to see. And I feel like I needed to test this a bit further because we already fucking won the European war. Well, we might as well, might as well at least for Russia try something different. Ah, uh, get some night vision for the vampire. Ah. Oh, gotta remember speaking up with 
confidence, as All someone right. told me. I've seen that a lot recently, but I have noticed that I do sound better. So I'm going to try to do that more often. Ish. Hmm. New Slav versus Montenegro. Well, at least we got. There's a reason. There's a reason why I got the. Uh, Production cost. Yeah, so that way I can test stuff out. But she just idea that's probably really damn stupid, but I I just wanna test it out just a wee bit. More fuel we're finding. Kind of attache, even though we don't really need to. Uh, industries being pimped out. Start pimping this stuff out. Resources. Gotta pimp out this armor one way or another. Right, so, how the fuck did they have zero, in uh, zero infrastructure there? Almost swallowed. Me. Not really. <coughs> Not really swallowed. More like I was choked on my own spit. The viewers get involved in that. Since they're focusing on over here, they're gonna be fighting two fronts. E. E. It's gonna probably really fucking suck about that. Have this. Actually, we'll do this. That's so all we can get the claims here. this not mm. this ain't not bad but I don't know how we're gonna <laughs> clear that deficit of equipment so I just read we're still using taught what the fuck I am so fucking forgetful about shit, like, goddamn. Oh, manpower for garrisons. Why, why don't I use the, uh... Why don't I use these guys? Yeah, that should clear things up. So, let's start focusing on Artie. Because I fucking don't remember. No, I don't remember just like fucking forget a lot. I focus on one thing and I focus on 
Well, then I don't realize I need to do this and this and that, and then, yeah, it's not, it's not good. But, at least we're slowly getting more and more resources, the troops be speeding up towards the front. Our infrastructure be popping. Infrastructure be popping. Our tanks be all there. Hands of core. You're not complete crap. Hmm. There's some extreme environmental training. Angetreten. I should probably start with some of this. Kevrek, Signal, and NG. And we'll expand you just a wee bit. Actually, we could try some of this. Hmm. Marching into the Alps. Just gonna try something. Try a lot of things. So since we're actually, you know, doing something with that one. Let's read Friesen und Niederlande. The Friesen and Dutch people do not speak German, but they are Germanic and only to influence of the Christian Spaniards, not part of Germany. We should rectify this. I think you also get a like, claim for Alonia, like... Pretty sure like most of the time the Wallonia is not gonna... <laughs> Low and hell the Wallonia is not... Gonna be a part of France. Oh uh, yeah, they still got all of these. This is still degenerate even after being liberated. Some more. Get you all some more. I guess we could start uh, training some of these. I'm not even using these. I will get rid of them. And the cannons. A cannon. Let's get some of these. It's a long war. You probably call this the big build up. As we prepare to make sure that we have everything that we need. And I test now on an idea that probably won't even work on right it. Got plenty of steel. We have aluminum. I think that's aluminum, I don't remember. Uh, it was by a German. We should reintroduce this state. Uh, 
Might as well just in, just in case you want to finish your beat up here into submission. You can add the English onto that, maybe. Potentially. Possibly. Maybe. Destruction, better air superiority, some more tanks on their way. Yep, it's just just like before, we'll be building up, making sure that once we do this shit, it's gonna be glorious. Just you wait. And so, yeah, Alsace Lorraine is ours. Also, we loan, also ours. And there's a core. Processing. I'm gonna build that up because we can't even go there. And that looks good. I'm gonna build that one up just in case. I'll go pimp that out. Because apparently, Madagascar doesn't want that. Shots, ye kind of stale meeting there. So front stale meeting. I think I know exactly why. Ah, oh, man, that's good. Uh, and then really is gonna take for fucking ever. Uh, let's do Asta Vito. Now it's time to go east and show the Russians to my the new Germanic people. Soon. They will tremble. All who oppose the revolution shall fear its wrath. I probably read that actually, you know. I don't think I ever did read that. So let's uh, read that. National vanguardism is a term used to describe a mix between nationalistic and socialist ideas, socialistic ideas, and policies. It usually varies from country to country depending on the local popular strand of nationalism and soft socialism, but generally supports a state one economy and a one party state. Which we see it's like a fucking Nazbol. In fact, in fact, would this be Nazbol? I, I don't, it doesn't. I've never really read up on anything about that, but it doesn't, it doesn't sound like it. I don't know if, if you guys know if that's kind of like Nazbol or some other weird. <laughs> It's a little weird ass ideology that I don't know of because it's fucking extremely free. And then, then let me know in the comments. <sighs> Not much there. Uh, are they influencing this? Like terror. Oh yeah, I think they went with uh, 
So we got the black block starting caliber forms. Yeah, it is in the start caliber forms. Infrastructure doing nice. Oil, pretty damn good. This is fuel me, so I'm building that. And I'll just get <clears throat> very into Deutsches. With Germany finally reunited, we have fulfilled our destiny. Yeah, we basically have all Germanic peoples up right over here, Poland. I guess Poland can have that. Po Polska. I guess we can do this. And second to see what's over here. Could do that, but. Let's get the Conic Seager. Even though we're socialists, we still call it the Conic Seager. Uh, I guess Tiger 2. Get that up there. So that way, once it kicks off, we can all, we already have like plenty of fuel in the reserves. I like how it's NMAPDL, but there's no like R. L being left, R being right. Romania is getting invaded. They're starting to form their own. Uh, doing a whole Vulcan. Vulcan. Nah, pff, fuck. <laughs> fucking Vulcan. Vulcan Hyperborea. Fucking Vulcan Hyperborea, dumbass. Call myself a dumbass because. Fucking said Vulcan. Vulcan Hyperborea. What the fuck? Uh, I, I just do stupid shit sometimes. I, I don't even know. It's just Vulcan Hyperborea, not Vulcan. Very near Deutsches. You know that. We did some of this, we could do some of these. But let's start focusing on these because we might as well. We have a mighty navy. We need a glorious fleet that represents the might of both the German people and the Red Revolution. We need a higher ships in the dark depths of the sea. If we go to to Britain, we'll show them who's boss. Well, the people are now the boss. Boss. You were Slav. You were Slav things. What are you doing over here? And troops all the way out there, like. I sent troops over there. Uh, the air is so goddamn weird. Many other tents. It's a German army in small numbers, that's neat. 
the vampire. Let's get improve inventory equipment three. And we have a formula like greater Germany. A German who surpassed all Germanys. Oh yeah, it's this song. I like this song. I feel like it fits with uh, what we're doing. Hmm. Yeah. Yeah, this song definitely fits with what we're doing. Nothing much really is happening in this episode, but I guess that's the silly consequences of when you have an idea that you want to try out. Ooh. 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 Maybe. Maybe. I've got plenty of ideas after seeing that now. Plenty of ideas after seeing that. Uh, a little more airfields. Some of the boys there. Actually, you know what? Start finishing up some of this. Ooh. 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 It's getting good now. Start calling this shit. And you know what? Hmm. You know what? Thus, end the episode here. Next time, after building up, we are finally going to war with Russia. And perhaps this. Hmm. I guess I'll, I'll think about it when we're waiting in Russia. I might end the series here. After that, we about go off to England. Then finish it. But as of now, for this episode, we build up. And it seems like Russia is slowly killing itself. So, I'm the mad artist. And until then, I'll see you all later.